Hey everyone, this is a Dynagen TG410 generator controller. It's used for uh, instrumentation, monitoring, protection, control of your Aurora generator. Uh, this is a standard controller that we use on all our generators. I just want to show you what it looks like when you first uh, power on your generator, turn the key on, uh, power up the controller. First thing you'll see is an amber light and a little warning message here that it's not an automatic. You have it in manual right now. Not an automatic, but start is enabled. You can start it manually if you want. If you have an automatic transfer switch or you're off grid and you want your charge controller perhaps to turn on the generator and recharge batteries for you, just put it in auto. It's now waiting for a signal from your transfer switch or your generator uh, uh, start system. Um, just looking for an open and closed contact on two pins inside, uh, two, on two terminals to tell it to start and stop. But I don't have a transfer switch connected right now. I want to run it manually even though it's waiting to start. Uh, I'm going to press off. It's going to tell me again it's not an auto, amber light there, which is not, not a, it's a warning, it's not an error. Uh, but I can start it. I'm going to press run. It'll go through a sequence here of preheating the engine, turns glow plugs on, tells me don't put a load on just yet. Uh, it's still preheating, glow plugs are on. Now it's going to crank. You might see the voltage drop a little bit on the battery while it's cranking. Not so much on this unit because it's a display unit and the battery voltage is fixed. And we don't actually have glow plugs turning on. But once the engine is started and it's past the warm-up period on here, then it starts monitoring the sensors and we'll cycle through different um, different displays on here. You can hold and lock the screen here by just pressing the enter once and I pressed it twice by mistake. There we go, lock screen, a uh, little lock symbol here and I'm seeing how much power I'm drawing off the generator. I can see the, the amperage on the um, line one and two or A and B, um, generator voltage the runtime, uh, the total engine runtime, that's not accurate because this is a demo unit that's been uh, on my desk here as a display and teaching tool, uh, but that's a lot of hours. Uh, battery voltage, AC frequency, oil pressure, engine speed, real power, engine temperature, power factor, apparent power. You may not be inter too interested in this stuff, but the information is there if you need it. Um, great controller it really helps protect the generators and makes using them simple it's made by dynagen this model is a tg410 and uh, you can find out more about it on our website on aurora generators.com